Hello everybody and welcome to my channel. I'm Bianca and in today's video I'm going to be doing another train with me. Uh, yeah, today is an update day but uh, SSO only released the new quarter horses and as I'm not going to be buying any one of, one of them, I kind of figured that uh, doing an update video where I don't even buy any of the new horses would be kind of pointless. We're going to be training my new Connemara. His name is Sunshine, aka Sam, and he is adorable. I love him so much. So let's get right into a training. I haven't done one of these in a while, really. I mean, I've had... I did chumps with me, but I haven't done a train with me in a while where I just get to kind of chat and train my horses. But there hasn't really been any need for me to like uh, make a video in order to get my horses trained up because these days it's super easy what with the druid training and missions and uh, uh, the ranch which gives you like so much xp so much xp so i've managed to max almost whoops all of my horses super fast so i haven't really felt like doing a train with me but today i just kind of figured why not? Oh my god, this is not going well. <laughs> anyway, there have been a lot of new series and stuff on my channel. I hope you guys have liked them. I've also gained a lot of followers, like 20 something followers, subscribers, what are they called on this website, <laughs> uh, in the past few weeks, which has been absolutely mind blowing. So thank you to everyone who's subscribed to my channel because. I just really like doing these videos, it's such a fun hobby for me and it makes this game more interesting and, I don't know, engaging somehow. I feel like I have something to look forward to and do, so yeah, I really appreciate every single one of you who has subscribed to my channel and I hope you will continue enjoying my content. Oh yeah, I was supposed to mention that our club, Zany Cats, has an Instagram page now, which is at SSO Zany Cats. If you would like to go and give our page a follow, we're a club for adult players, so if you're interested and you happen to play on the Spring Star server, make sure to check out our club Instagram. SSO Zany Cats for any information and how to apply and stuff. We don't actually have applications or anything. We're just, you know, a chill, relaxed club. We don't really have any uh, strict dressage competition events or anything like that. We don't actually do dressage that much because we don't have anyone who uh, would actually want to host those kinds of events, but uh, maybe that could be you. Maybe you could hold uh, dressage practices for our club because I would totally be interested in that, but I just... Uh, I just can't be bothered to actually host those things myself because I don't think I know enough about the subject. I've done uh, SSO dressage like once. It was really nice though, I liked it and it looked super cool when we... Oh, where am I going? I need to get to Virgo, come on, come on. When we managed to uh, get the moves right, it looked sick, so yeah. I'm not opposed to Star Stable dressage, I'm just... Uh, not very educated on it. I think they should introduce the fast uh, turns of the ranch pole bending and barrel racing to all of the pole bending and barrel racing races in the game. Well, this one and and Marley's barrel racing. I think those are the only ones that have it anymore since uh, Josh's uh, pole bending is now gone from Moreland, but 
oh my god can you please not mess up but yeah i think it would be nice if they could introduce the fast turns to uh all of these because because yeah now that i've uh, had the experience of doing it with the fast turns uh this is really uh, annoying to do nowadays I still haven't quite figured out these new fur grow races. They're they're lovely. I love how they look, but I can't do them very fast. Like I don't know any of the shortcuts. I just um, do them like. Oh yeah, you can do that. Oh wow, yeah. Okay, that was clever. But yeah, I do love what they've done with this place. It's it looks really nice. These are probably like aesthetically my favorite races in the game, but I think my absolute favorite races must be the equestrian center, the vineyard races, because I'm the best at them. So <laughs> Someone's talking, I hope you guys didn't hear that. Oh my god, what's going on? Okay, I think it stopped. I'm still staying uh, with my family due to... Uh, due to the current situation of the world so sometimes interesting to like I realize that I'm not just alone because I live alone like normally under normal circumstances it's been an interesting month I do have to admit oh my god this race looks so nice so nice I ca I'm kind of hoping that they would oh my god oh my god update uh, hollow woods next because that race and that forest is in sore need of an upgrade. But I just love the graphics and like this art style that SSO has these days. I love it. It's somehow very uh, like suitable to my taste, I guess. I know some people preferred the like old art art style, the less cartoonish art style, I suppose, but. I've always been um, in the camp of liking the cartoonish styles for games like these, like, uh, kind of like in The Sims, people who are avid supporters of The Sims 3 usually don't like the art style of The Sims 4, but I personally just love the art style of The Sims 4, and that's why I played Maxis Match, and I don't have a lot of Alpha CC. Some of my clothes may be a bit on the Alpha side. But I usually go with the Maxis Match uh, CC for my game because I just like that sort of look. So I'm very happy with what Star Stable has done with these new new graphics and updated areas. I'm hoping that what they're going to be doing with our character sometime in the future is going to be super cute because like. Uh, looking at the new NPCs that we've gotten with the ranch, they look real cute. So if our character is going to be anything like that, uh, then I won't be mad at all. I think it's also, uh, like, I think the Soul Riders are also a good marker towards what they're going to be doing with our characters, so... I'm excited for that. I'm going to be making, like... A video of me giving a makeover to all three of my characters like all three of my accounts are going to glow up I'm just kind of worried about what's going to happen to all our clothes and hairs like are these old hairs going to fit the new models probably not oh my god oh my god so are they going to update the hairs as well and if we get a different body shapes, then what about the clothes? That's probably a lot of work on the SSO team's part. I hope it's gonna... I hope we're not gonna like lose everything and have to... Uh, that wouldn't make any sense. They wouldn't do that, I'm pretty sure. Let's head to the ranch. I'm gonna take a look at the uh, quarters, even though I'm not going to get any of them. But I still want to take a look. Any animals here that I could grab on the way? Oh my god, there's a cow. There's a cow. Let's grab this cow and take it to Mary on our way. Ooh, 
hope we got a level up. Sam's now level 6. That's great. That was my goal for today's video. Oh my god. Hi everyone. There's a lot of people here. Okay, I'm kind of regretting my decision to not get one. These are so cute, but I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. I spent I think a few weeks with Honeybee, training Honeybee and stuff. And I just, I mean, these horses are really cute and the animations are really cute, but I don't know if they're exactly to my tastes. Like, I get that many of you who ride in real life have a lot of, like, IRL experience with the American Quarter Horse, which is why uh, you guys probably like them a lot, which I get totally, besides these horses, even if you've never seen an American Quarter Horse in your entire life, these horses are still, like, super cute, so... But I'm not going to get one today, because I just... I don't think it's necessarily the breed for me. So I'm just gonna be happy with my one American Quarter Horse, and that's about it. I Usually I don't buy many of the same breed anyway, even if I like the breed a lot. I do have two of the Irish Cobs, but I was like really excited for that breed. I even made a reaction video on it, so... So yeah, because the, uh, uh, the old version of the Irish Club was the first horse I ever bought with star coins in this game, so... Oh, whoops. Oh my god. So I was really excited for the updated one, but I'm not going to... Uh, oh my god, why is this so going so badly? So no, uh, I don't think I will be buying another American Quarter Horse. But what I may be buying sometime in the near future, if SSO team will, would just put uh, a double star coin weekend uh, out, then I might be buying another Andalusian because I really love that breed a lot in this game. The new, uh, the new updated version is so elegant and pretty, and I love it. So, 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 so much. So, I might be buying a new Andalusian sometime in the near future, so keep an eye out for that. I might do a video about it. Oh my god, oh my god. Or not. I didn't do a video when I bought my Shinkatik pony, and I didn't do a video when I bought Sam, because I'm not myself the biggest fan of uh, horse buying videos. I do make them occasionally. Like... I don't have anything like very harshly against them, but I just find other video ideas to be more engaging to me. So that's why I don't make a new buying a horse video every time I buy a new horse. Does that make any sense? I don't know. I don't know, guys. But the Connemara deal was really good, so I decided to buy this one. Uh, and I haven't regretted it not one bit. I've had so much time in my hand to play this game in quarantine, so... So it's nice to have actual horses to train and not just uh, get bored. Uh, and, and, and regret everything. Oh my god, Beatrice, stop being better than me at this. I hate this part. Okay, okay. Okay, okay, we nearly made it, but then we messed up at the very last minute, sadly enough. Okay, guys, that wraps up today's video. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this a little bit of a different Wednesday video. Next week, I hope to make an update video again, but we'll see. Anyways, thank you so, so much for watching, as always. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to give it a like, leave a comment down below, subscribe to my channel, all that jazz, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye!